Welcome to the Create with Katrina Julia show by Fit Life Creation, where we talk all the things on wellness, faith, marketing, business, and travel to create a life and business you love. I've been there, friend. I've walked from fear to faith, self-hate to love, corporate to calling, and bondage to freedom, along with transformation in every area of my life. I'm right here with you, walking along on my own path to creating. So tune in so that you learn how to create a life and business you love, hands on. Let's create it. Welcome to How Is Your Marketing? In this video, I'm going to be diving deep into one of my tools that I have to really help you get clear on your marketing, on your annual plan, on your business to business strategy, and for you to have an assessment on how your marketing is at this moment now. So my first question for you friends is what have you completed with the foundation of your marketing? So you might be thinking, hmm, what does Katrina mean? I'm so glad you asked. So I mean your mission, your values, and your vision. I mean your personal branding and your colors. And you guys, if you are loving this assessment, head on over to my bit.ly down below, bit.ly backslash create it like a boss, and you can fill out the assessment and get some feedback and learn all about my fractional CMO program and a lot more in that link too, okay? So that's what I'm glancing at as you see me glancing at over at my computer because I know it for the most part, but I, you know, I'm human and we sometimes need bullet points or different things, right? To help us out. So number three, do you have a personal website and or a blog? Take note friends. I haven't mentioned anything about social media yet. Because if you truly want to build a brand and you truly want to have people's and brands eyeballs on you, now, if you want to just run your business on Instagram or you want to just run your business on YouTube, have at it friends, but keep in mind, you do not own those platforms. You do not have that contact information saved and you are only monetizing to a degree and the monetization is controlled by them. So you're missing out on courses. You're missing out on potentially events, retreats, brand engagements beyond those platforms. Yes, Google, Airbnb, WeWork, there's lots of brands that will work with you only on Instagram, but don't you want to maybe have long-term ongoing deals with them? Just saying. So back to the assessment. Speaking of, do you have a media kit and a biography page? You can see an example of mine at fitlifecreation.com backslash creator. Now I would be amiss if I did not say what you're getting from these videos, from this series, from the, the information that I share is not solely at all like, oh, me just knowing this, you guys. No, no, no. This is faith. This is prayer. This is investment in time and free resources as well as paid resources. I've been a student of Brendan Bouchard's for years. I've been a student of Marie Forleo's now for the second year in a row as of this recording. I'm a student of Jasmine Stars. So I am constantly pouring into myself both on a free basis and on a paid basis. And that doesn't even count the faith resources and communities, the wellness, the money, the marketing, the business, the travel, and the other communities. Speaking of, you can see all of that in my 75 plus tools and resources to create it, a life and business you love that I've also included down below as part of this experience. Okay, back to the assessment. Your LinkedIn profile. Is your LinkedIn profile updated? One of the uh, most amazing things is not only getting you know messages, but utilizing LinkedIn to connect with people you know, directly. I also scale that with my virtual assistant and have a clear message that she sends out to targeted lists of people, which by the way, you get some of those targeted lists as well in some of my experiences. And 
Now let's talk about some more in social media. Oh, real quick on LinkedIn. If you have your LinkedIn profile updated and you can see mine as an example, like you have your intro, you have your highlights, you have some articles or some things. Another thing that many people miss out on you guys is recommendations. Ask for recommendations and give recommendations. I give more than I receive. You'll see that on my LinkedIn as a clear example, but it is a perfect way to connect with people even further and for them to see like, see recommendations and insight beyond from you, that these are other people you've worked with speaking about you, okay? So the next question is, have you at least started Instagram, okay? So I can tell you some of my stories or part of my story is my first year in on Facebook, sharing my before and after with my wellness results, the business grew 25 times simply in the wellness component, okay? So, so I started asking the question, okay, what if I created this in a community? What if I created this on other social platforms? What if I joined with other creators and brands? Imagine the results over time. Ding, 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 right? Then, did you, have you at least started Pinterest? Have you at least started YouTube and or TikTok? And do you have at least of presence of over 5,000 people on at least one channel. Because what that's gonna show me and tell you, friends, is that you are consistent and you are gaining traction on at least one media channel. Significant traction, okay? And it's not to say anything under that is not good. You could just be in process, but that shows me a level of consistency over time. And creating and consistency in any area of life is so, so, so important. Hi, I'm Katrina Julia. I am a multi-passionate entrepreneur, traveler, athlete, creator, and CEO of Fit Life Creation, and I love helping entrepreneurs and mission-based brands create it a life and business you love. I've had experience in over seven different industries, I'm an MBA and a CPA, and I've worked with brands like Victoria's Secret, NBC The Apprentice, Google, and Airbnb, and over 15,000 plus creators, entrepreneurs, and influencers as well. So let's create it. So after years in the making, I can say right now, because I'm taking the assessment with you as I walk through this, I can say on foundation, I am there. I checked off every single one. But again, this has been years in the making, tech, tools, and teams, okay? And I want that for you because if you're listening to this, likely you are a creator and or a mission-based brand and you deeply desire to create a life and business you love with freedom with community. So now let's get into what have you completed with the stability of your marketing? So. If you've tuned in in the past into my videos, I talk about foundation, stability, and growth, and I talk about strategy, structure, and systems, because everything to me is driven first from the strategy, like what is the GPS, where are we headed, what is the structure, what is the business model, what are the revenue streams, and what are the systems? What are the systems with tech, with tools, with teams? How are we simplifying to amplify? And then with that in mind, the way that my brain is wired is, okay, let's think about the foundation so that we do not have instability, so that we don't have feast or famine, so we don't have abundance and lack, okay? So the foundation is firm, and that's what we just talked about. Then we get into the stability. And then how are things stability? And that's why I just talked about you guys, if you're paying attention, consistency and then growth. So instability, you are monetizing in at least two to three ways that are clear. Let me say that again for the people in the back. You're monetizing in at least two or three ways. Well, Katrina, what does that mean? That means you're making money in at least two to three ways. Maybe you're getting collaborations off of Instagram. Maybe you have a signature high-end program. Maybe you have a challenge in Facebook that you run every single month. 
whatever it is, you're monetizing at least two to three ways. And the reason why I say two to three, you guys, is because especially if you are monetizing both business to business, so higher end ongoing money coming in, that tells me that you are much more abundance focused and you're also taking care of you and you believe you are worthy. And if you have a second or third, that also shows me already you have the seedlings and you're already growing into business to consumer, into passive income, into online programs, whatever that is, into ongoing commitments and retainers from brands, into retreats, take your pick. But it means you are growing and you are very intentional about that growth. Better yet, when you have the launches line up B to B to C, and that's where I'm at now. And it's so exciting, you guys. And the flow starts happening easier and easier and easier. And the actions through the simplicity and then amplifying the alignment and the action start happening so much easier. And then the tips, tools, and teams just magnify it all. Like I, I'm blown away myself in gratitude, like where I'm at now and the levels of, I call it Godfidence. Some of you call it confidence, but Godfidence plus action compared to say last year, compared to 90 days ago and the clarity. Okay. And that comes through consistency and action and putting yourself out there to create it. Number two, you have a financial forecast and tool you use to track results regularly. So I'm going to tell on myself here also, because don't think Katrina Julia arrived at, oh, planet, um, everything's just working out all the time and life and business is like a waterfall. Ah, no. Okay. No, 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 no. There has been times throughout my entrepreneurial journey more than I care to admit of lack of living off debt, of needing money from family and like scarcity and lack and fear. Even though I worked in strategy, finance and operations and made six figures with corporate, generated six to eight figures consistently because it is different and it hits different when you're the one creating and scaling a life and business you love. And it's, I joke, but not joke that like entrepreneurship is often like running through the streets naked. Like it requires such a level of vulnerability and facing yourself. And one of my blog posts, I talk about how transformation is required to create a life and business you love, because if you're not healing and you're not developing and you're not growing in the process and releasing thoughts or beliefs that no longer serve you friends, it's going to show up in your life and your business. I am living proof. Okay. So in 2020, I woke up um, well, I wake up all the time in different levels, right? But 2020, I, it was almost like a ding, ding, ding that I realized a couple things. One, I wasn't celebrating all my wins. I was being super hard on myself. Two, I realized, Katrina, you don't have a dashboard. You have always run departments or groups or teams off dashboards and like key performance indicators and you created them. Why aren't you running your life and your business on one? So one of the things as I was implementing ClickUp, I realized, I said, wait a minute, let's set up a dashboard. I, it's one of the reasons why I love ClickUp, their tool, the interaction with the team, the automation and the dashboard. So I created a dashboard and then I created my first version of a goal sheet that tied into goals, you know, overall for life and business in ClickUp. But then the spreadsheet included goals overall in the business then business to business goals and conversions, then business to consumer goals and conversions with social media, with email list and things like that. So that I knew at least once a week or once a month, I was tracking and I'm tracking these metrics and I'm helping others create it too. Speaking of number three, you have a visual dashboard where you track regularly what's happening with your tasks, your sprints, your launch, your money, your priorities, like all the things. So I have a visual dashboard, with seven plus uh, graphs, but then I also have top three priorities all the time that greet me when I go in to click up, okay? You have at least one online automated freebie to build your email list. That is your currency, friends. I send out different things like moneymaker emails or other things or my newsletter or created uh, creator confessions. That is your moneymaker. That is where you're cultivating on deeper levels 
connection with people. Yes, it's on social. Yes, it's, you know, via email. But once people enroll into your freebies, into your newsletter, you begin to cultivate a deeper connection and community with them. And do not overlook that. You have at least one proven marketing strategy, strategy that gets you, listen up, consistent leads monthly. Okay, at least one. You are sharing at least one offer monthly to monetize. So that tells me also that you're consistent in your marketing and you are not being shy and you know it's not about you, that you are putting yourself out there in your business. You have a clear business to business and business to consumer launch strategy, strategy overlapping at least three channels. Some of you just blew up your brain. Some of you are like, what is she talking about? Sounds like she's speaking Spanish. Yo hablo también español, si quieres hablar conmigo. I also speak Spanish, for those of you that didn't know what I just said. Um, so let me break it down. Business is business means you are reaching out to people in leaders and directors and VPs in Fortune 500 companies in HR, in marketing, take your pick, right? And or you are pitching brands directly for ongoing projects, for retainers, for influencer engagements ongoing business to business, not one off, not scarcity, you're developing relationships and business to consumer is, you know, maybe on Instagram, maybe on YouTube, maybe on uh, Skillshare, whatever that is, right? But then there's overlap between them that you're sharing on at least three channels, like say email, um, such as Instagram and LinkedIn, boom, done, right? So that gives you a clear example of what I mean right? So it's not complicated, you guys. And one of the things I tell people all the time is marketing is really just sharing. And marketing and influencer marketing is simply word of mouth. And when you start to reframe your brain to those mindsets and like uh, talking to a friend, like uh, Ashley, when we went on uh, our Cuba retreat, that was one of the things she said when I was so at first paralyzed on talking on video. She said to me, she said, Katrina, all it is really is just pretend as if you're talking to your best friend. And then it was as if a magical light bulb went off in my brain. You are using at least one financial tool to manage your money in your business. QuickBooks, Mint, again, take your pick. I utilize Financial Peace University. I utilize QuickBooks. I utilize Life Plan. I use a lot, utilize Clever Girl Finance. Those are just some of the tools and the resources to help, okay? You are on at least one marketing platform to bring you business. So some of you may consider that Instagram, but is it truly bringing you business regularly? But then to me, that can also be a platform like Brain Trust or Indeed as an example for those two. So comment down below on what is resonating with you on the second question and if you've taken the assessment yet. So let's talk about the stability of your business in terms of the assessment. So I highly, highly encourage you, if you haven't yet, take the assessment because it is going to blow your mind, okay? So stability, you are monetizing at least two to three ways and clear on your next step. You have a financial forecast and a tool you use to track results regularly, okay? You have used a visual dashboard and or you've created one to track regularly what's happening with your top three priorities and your money. You have at least one online automated freebie to build your email list. Automated, case in point. You have at least one proven marketing strategy that's getting you consistent leads monthly, whether that's outreach, whether that's a platform, whether that's social media, take your pick, okay? You are sharing at least one offer monthly to monetize on a consistent basis. You, are, you have a clear business to business to consumer strategy with at least three channels. So maybe you're outreaching to brands via email and or you have an email strategy and that's tying to your social media and it's on three different platforms, automated and or delegated as a quick example, okay? You are using at least one financial tool to manage your money and your business. 
and you are on at least one marketing platform to bring you business, okay? So think about all of those things and would love to know what results you end up getting on the assessment. Way through the assessment, just so you know where we're at on this part, okay? And I made it this in depth on purpose because I really wanted you to dig deep to see for yourself where you are, okay? If you're answering this, I'm simply guiding you through the assessment as an extra bonus on top of the assessment that's already at the link, okay? So what have you done in the past to create and scale your marketing? This is a really, really, really important question. Every question is important on the assessment, but this is really, really important. DIY, invested in one coach, implemented over three items, invested in an online program, completed an online program in the first 90 days that you enrolled, gotten at least three results. So where are you with creating and scaling and the actions and initiatives that you've taken and the investments? So what's interesting is you guys, I created this assessment and I didn't actually even take it myself until now. And I am a huge believer in perfect aligned timing. And what I'm taking it as I'm recording these videos and I'm finding so far, I've checked off every single one, but keep in mind, this is now seven years in the making. So I want to save you time and money and heartache and frustration and all the things, whether you simply engage with me on this assessment, whether you jump into deeper relationships in different ways with the freebies, you know, the courses, you know, different experiences, but either way, like, Einstein said it, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. Let's stop that, please. We are human beings, not human doings, and let's stop beating our heads against the wall and let's stop throwing spaghetti on the wall, okay? Two things with the wall, let's stop. So now let's get into growth with marketing. And you know, modern marketing has absolutely changed in so many exponential ways, right? So, you know, it, part of my story is I, you know, I'm also an MBA, I'm also a CPA. I've worked in seven plus industries in strategy and in finance, predominantly in operations. But I recognize the deep need, two things. I recognize the deep need for me to educate and immerse myself in modern marketing in around 2015. And then I also remembered how great I was at it organically back in college and simply sharing word of mouth about organizations I was in, things that I was you know, creating, co-creating in teams and communities. And I started applying those same principles in the framework of modern marketing, being authentic, engaging, creating foundations, stability, growth, and then also taking the things that I learned in corporate, that I learned, you know, in serving in different avenues, that I learned in having, you know, various different businesses and then creating Fit Life Creation and create it, you know, a life and business you love, create it like a boss and recognized at, through my own growth and development and pouring into myself, the things that were, are required for strategy, structure, systems, foundation, stability, and growth. And that is what the intention of this video is and this, you know, this experience and what I want to give to you to save so much time, energy, money, et cetera. Okay. So let's get into the growth. You are automating at least five things on your website, your blog, and social media. And some of you, just coward. And, or some of you are curious and excited and are asking, Katrina, what do you mean by that? So glad you asked. You're using maybe different tools to automate posts from one social media platform to another. You are delegating different things to free up your time intentionally. Whether it's social media, whether it's business development, whether it's research or all the above. You are on at least one to five business development platforms and or Facebook groups getting at least seven plus regular leads monthly. 
so that people are aware of who you are. People are aware of what you do. After I finish filming this video, these videos, I have something coming up later on today in the community that I'm a part of. It's exactly that. You are collaborating with at least seven creators, influencers, and partners quarterly, at least seven to again, expand awareness, connect, serve community. You have bundled digital and physical products together ongoing, like in a subscription model or things like that. Your launches include at least four platforms with repurposed content. Like this content is getting repurposed in seven plus ways. Some of you also just wondered, how is she doing that? How does she still have time for wellness? Teams, tech, and tools. I start with first strategy. I outline steps. Then my, my first go-to is tech. It is 2023 as of the recording of this video. There are so many different ways to scale and leverage with tech. Then, uh, well, first it's tips. Like I think of things, you know, in terms of making it simpler, simplified to amplify. Then I go to tech and then I go to teens to delegate, okay? Then beyond that, you have pitched and negotiated brands for long-term six-figure deals. So notice I didn't say one deals. I said you have pitched and are negotiated long-term deals because that tells me initiative, that tells me confidence, okay? You have launched a live event or retreat in the last five years. And the reason why I did it five years was because obviously with the pandemic and all the different things, uh, there were some shifts or some shifts that some of us chose to accept or allow or invite, or some of us like me that chose to literally fly away and travel for almost two years through three continents and 10 countries. That's a whole nother topic and a whole nother video. You have reached a minimum of $10,000 months with your business. That tells me also a lot of initiative, a lot of focus, a lot of not giving up, a lot of persistence and perseverance that you've overcome so many different mindsets, so many different lies in your mind. And I want to take a moment to pause because there's power in the pause. And I want to acknowledge you. I want to acknowledge all of you for showing up and listening this far along. Okay. Number one. I'm so grateful for you. I'm so grateful that you're choosing to create it. But number two, if you've reached that level, there's a level of faith, of action, of persistence, of perseverance that is required to be here now. So celebrate that. Get something, do an experience, take yourself out to lunch if you haven't yet. Celebration is so underrated. I That's one of the things that I want to encourage more people to do is celebrate it, celebrate, celebrate, celebrate. You are delegating at least 10 items monthly to a VA and or a part-time contractor. You have at least a plan for your first full-time contractor and or employee. You have achieved time freedom. You have achieved location freedom. So that's the growth segment. Comment down below on where you're at in growth in the assessment. And if you haven't yet, definitely take the online assessment down below. Okay, now that we've walked through the foundation, the stability and the growth and the question on investment, now I want you to really go within and let me know which stage do you most resonate with? Is it foundation? you have a personal brand, you have some social media channels and you're making some money. Those are the three triggers or indicators when I think of foundation. Stability, you have all the above and you're building your email list. You have at least one freebie. You're monetizing at least one item regularly and launching it consistently. And you have at least one regular income lead, incoming lead source. Okay, so that's stability. Number three, growth. I have all the above, have scaled some, and have worked with some creators and have consistent income, typically over $10,000 a month. So comment where you're at with what stage currently. Okay, so what do you have left to complete? 
now that you've seen the assessment, now you've walked through all the things, what do you have left to complete in your marketing? Now let's get into what option are you most interested in for your marketing function? Are you most interested in the fractional CMO as a regular ongoing partner in your business? Fractional CMO online and group coaching and or one month beta and a personal CMO monthly or the one month beta and the CMO online. So obviously I'm also using this for market research and would love to see you weigh in. So where are you with your marketing now? So if you are ready to get started with a fractional CMO like a boss, head on over to the link below where you can dive deep into the assessment and learn much, much more about the program. Let's create it. And remember, create, transform, and inspire because you are born to. Let's create it. Are you looking for a fractional CMO like a boss to create your marketing like a boss from A to Z? For creators to CEOs and mission-based brands. I've gotten the opportunities to work with brands like Google, Airbnb, Thrive Global, Kajabi, ClickUp, Activate, Simple Truth, and much, much more. A fractional CMO Chief Marketing Officer is for creators to CEOs and mission-based brands to create and scale marketing like boss with foundation, stability, and growth with strategy, structure, and systems limitlessly. A marketing roadmap from A to Z for the year, B2B business to business development, integration seamlessly with business to consumer, meaning digital marketing, your emails, social media, influencer marketing, content creation, while creating and scaling your marketing function with freedom, flow, and focus. Some of the reviews say Katrina is an amazing person, super focused and goal oriented. I had both the pleasure and the opportunity to work with her with creating my business from scratch. She helped me simplify tasks and focus on priorities, which reduced immensely the amount of time it would have taken me to set up our community. Whether you are looking to set up a business, marketing, run events, travel tips, or change in your lifestyle, she's got you covered. Gabrielle and Veronica at Vega Community Honduras. So what does strategy and structure and systems mean in terms of what we are talking about with fractional CMO? From A to Z, you will get implementation and execution of the foundation of a marketing function. In the first month, you will receive an annual roadmap, financial projections, B2B2C priorities in a modern marketing world, and a review and audit of your existing marketing activities. So you will know, hey, this is working. This is what you're doing great. This is what we get to tweak. This is what we get to shift. And this is what we get to implement. This alone takes some CMOs, chief marketing officers that command over $200,000 a year. Okay, let me say that again. $200,000 plus a year, about 90 days or more to execute. That means most of the time, this is costing companies about, give or take, $60,000 to even get to that, okay? And trust me, I know from working with corporate Fortune 500 companies, projects, sitting on a board of directors and much more. We do it for less than 5% on average and in your first month. The ROI alone is over 3,000%. Not to mention the time, the frustration, the headaches that you don't go through anymore and the results that will happen and how you will feel to have it handled. 
The foundation highlights the strategy of the fractional CMO, where you will get the roadmap, the 90 day to annual plan, the B2B to C priorities and project management. That's where we start to implement your structure and your dashboard, which leads me to stability helps you have clarity, education and direction every step of the way in your marketing. You will be in awe and wonder of the creation and implementation of your marketing with B2B to C strategies and structure in the first 90 days. From the B2B to C, the business to consumer to business to business to consumer strategy to the strategy structure and systems tracking results on a dashboard, you will finally feel the confidence you have been craving, my friends, in your marketing. You will receive consistent communication from myself and the community to let you know exactly where things are. All the chaos and the confusion will be gone and you will be left with solely clarity and calm, creativity, and confirmation of the results that are happening and on the way. You will learn and see firsthand implemented over seven platforms and communities and technology to increase the awareness, value, and growth of your brand. Step by step, you will see and learn how to structure your business by sharing your business in an authentic way. Business development platforms, how to pitch long-term business deals and them done for you access to lists, how to stay stable and consistent and abundant with all the moving parts. I am not available for scarcity, lack, confusion, doubt, and disbelief, my friends. That is part of what you're also going to get with some of the bonuses with the lifestyle and mindset and wellness programs too. The stability section highlights the structure of marketing where you will see your B2B2C strategies with checklists, with templates, with technology, with platforms, with communities, with social media, with influencer marketing, and how to launch. I can't tell you how many CEOs, COOs, CMOs that I've run across, and most of them aren't even integrating but 40% of this. And then they're adding in budgets for social and influencer and literally like, you know, paralyzed or afraid themselves that they don't have the skill sets or not aligning to the right communities and the right teams and not bringing the value to the company, to the creator and to the board of directors. Systems. Growth will give you the final pillar and fractional CMO like a boss to show you if you are not convinced yet, the limitless possibilities. You will experience firsthand the step-by-step process to automate your business, integrate new revenue streams limitlessly, access existing, access and assess existing profit margins, Line up your launch like a river, like a waterfall, integrate sponsorships, products, placements, creating events and or retreats. Yes, I am limitless and a fractional CMO is limitless. The growth section highlights the systems of the fractional CMO where you will get the roadmap, the weekly to annual plan, automation and delegation tips, tools and tech scaling your business, influencer marketing like a boss, events and retreats, how-tos, and depending on the plans you choose, a VA aligned to your team. Marissa with at Postcards to Seattle says she attended the Costa Rica retreat and got to rebuild, reframe, and scale her brand. You can dive deep step-by-step into the strategy, structure, and systems via the link in bio and scroll down to the fractional CMO like a boss. You will see things highlighted, like you can take the assessment for free. Then beyond that, the some of the bonuses in strategy include, or overall includes plus bonuses, personal branding, online presence, tips, tools, and tech, 
Bonuses include the assessment and annual plan of your existing strategy and marketing, B2B to C strategy to systems, updates, calls, strategy recommendations on both ends, modern marketing, plus the monthly membership in Create It is included so that your mindset, your wellness, your marketing, your business and travel is aligned to help you co-create a life and business you love with freedom. In structure, we are focusing on stability with monetizing in eight plus ways, vision, goal setting and tracking your finances, your marketing, your platform and your pitches. Bonuses include incredible tips and tools and financing, pricing tips and tech, web expansion, freebies list and examples, new and existing revenue evaluation and implementation, B2B to C launches and how they flow seamlessly, social media strategy and scaling, the time, frustration, and wasted money you would have spent, priceless. Systems, growth, the limitless ways a fractional CMO may help you build your brand to limitless growth for years to come. Include scaling with automating and delegating, leveling up to scale to online courses, launch lineups to integrate it all from B to B to C, influencer marketing like a boss, live events and retreats. Some bonuses include social media subscription with captions and pictures with social curator, products and bum bundling, implementing your VA, sponsorships and placements, upgrade options, four content bundles to have your service or products filmed personally by me or the team in local and or international destinations and or upgrade to attend our transformational retreats to immerse yourself in the community and create and learn firsthand and or bring your team and or have me do a co-creative retreat for your team personally. Cindy Boulanger says, Katrina has been a remarkable contributor in most areas of my three tourism brands in Costa Rica. Creative, productive, and organized. She contributed to marketing communication by blog posts and press releases, boosting website SEO, increasing visibility of online content, marketing materials to attract customers, creating experiences on Airbnb, contacting grants and investors, and social recommendations and many other ways to improve the business. In less than a week, she probably execute tasks that could be normally done in a month. I had a hard time catching up with her in my own company. These are not my words, friends. These are people that have worked with me firsthand and very closely. Along with her enthusiasm and positive energy, she is always a step ahead, constantly brings great business ideas, but most importantly, I would say, I know how to create it. She says she knows how to execute them. Her time is so well organized between the various responsibilities. She balances competing needs with a lot of professionalism. Besides, she is an outstanding digital writer with a creative approach. She is always ready for new challenges and writing opportunities, you will be impressed by her deep passion and commitment. It seems to be so easy for her to put the right words to the right places for everything to flow. The articles, the tour descriptions, the blog posts and press releases she wrote goes far beyond my expectations. As a perfectionist, multi-brand owner herself, Katrina could always understand perfectly what I wanted without much explanation. Side note, I'm not a perfectionist. I've, I'm a recovering perfectionist, you guys, but I am absolutely driven by service, purpose, passion, and high quality and progress. Thanks to Katrina, I can see progress, more revenues, and I am more motivated than ever to follow her business plan, which even allows me to take more time to myself. I highly recommend Katrina's marketing service, services. It is the push everybody needs to lift a business in the twinkling in an, of an eye. I will definitely work with her again. So definitely check out the landing page that I mentioned. And 
you will see a lot of frequently asked questions that you can dive in deep there, the free assessment that I mentioned, and then the breakdown of the CMO monthly options. And then once you complete the assessment, we will reach out for a 30 minute strategy call to answer any final questions and then get you started and then go from there to have you sign up for the monthly retainer and the onboarding call. I can't wait to see how you create it next. All the food chats on faith, wellness, money, marketing, business, and travel so you create a life if and business you haven't well. already. Head on over to the blog, the podcast, and the freebies to jumpstart your transformation. If you're ready to dive into the online courses, the live events, or the retreat. And if you want to create with our community on an even deeper level, definitely check out our internships, our influencer collaborations, management, and brand engagement. Let's create it.